The leading is not only with our leg, but it's with our hips. Hey, hey guys. guys, welcome to our channel. We are Roberto and Magdalena. And today we're going to show you body isolations with a partner, chest and hip, and how to lead and follow them. Let's go. <laughs> Okay guys, so let's start with the first one, which are the chest isolations. And in this case, we are in a close position with the woman. So let's do first a basic. We go on one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, eight. And on seven, eight is when we are starting the preparation for the isolation. So we do this by bringing her a little bit up to this side. So this side is like this and we bring it a little bit up and also we start by blocking her leg here so that she knows that she can no longer do the normal basic and also to give her a little bit more um, to make it easier for her to do the upper body isolations if we're already uh, blocking the lower side of her body. So also guys, make sure to have your frame. So in this case, our elbows are together in both sides and we don't have them like this and we also don't have them like this so we have them here in a comfortable position for the woman so we are in seven eight and now we start the upper body isolations by bringing her body to the left one the other side two and three tap and five six seven tap and also guys make sure to also do the isolations so we are not leading only with our hands and arms. We are also leading with our body. So let's do this one more time. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, tap, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, tap. So from this point of view, and one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, tap, and one, two, three, five six seven so guys like you just saw on three and tap we do it we're not going like this we're going one two three four five six seven eight this is possible to do as well but it's not really common and you're only doing it if it's really musical at the moment so normally we go like with our basic we do one two three tap five six seven eight but there's also other variations, for example, like a cha-cha, where we go one, two, cha-cha-cha, five, six, cha-cha-cha. So one tip for the follower, make sure not to clamp with your legs like this. This is not very comfortable for the leader. We have contact with our legs and our hips as well, but we don't need to clamp like this. We just keep connection and just make sure to practice them a lot also without a partner so that you are perfect at doing your own isolations and that way it's going to be even easier to do them with a partner so if this video is bringing you value so far make sure to like it this helps us a lot to grow and to reach more people if you're having trouble to do the body isolations make sure to check out this video where we explain the isolations alone so let's continue so now we're going to isolate our hips and in this case, we are also in a close position. We do a basic first. One, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, eight. And guys, make sure that we are close here. We have connection with our hips. And now we start leading the hips with our hips and also with our leg. So we go like this and we go one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, tap. So guys, make sure that you are not only moving your leg like this, because it's not only uncomfortable for the woman, but it's also because we lead with our body and not only with our extremities. <laughs> so we do it one more time. We go one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, tap. And guys, another tip is that we can also use this leg to help leading and to block the, the woman but we're not really doing this clamping so we're not doing a lot of pressure here just a little bit a little bit of contact and now from this point of view we go one two three tap five six seven tap and one two three tap five six seven tap and another tip guys just make sure to do the preparation correctly 
to do the preparation correctly, it is important that in seven, eight, we bring our hips outside. So that way it's more clear for the woman that it's something coming here. And that way we're not starting from here and then go like this. We're really bringing our hips outside. And from here we can go tack, tack, tack. So guys, combining the hips and the chest isolations, we are in a close position with our partner. And we go with a basic in one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, eight. So here we prepare, we prepare by bringing her a little bit up and to this side, and also by blocking her oh, lower body with our leg. That way she knows that isolations are coming upper body isolations and also it's not possible for her to do a basic. So from here we start with the upper body on one and then we follow with the hips on two, three, we go with the hips again and then upper body and we repeat them this one more time in five, six, seven, eight. And guys, make sure to also lead with your body. This means that we are not only using our arms but we're also moving our upper body and our hips as well. So it, the leading is not only with our leg, but it's with our hips. So from this point of view, it would look something like this, like one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, eight. So if you like this video, <laughs> make sure to check out our other videos. You're going to like them as well. We hope to see you in our next video. Bye. Bye.